Hey, what's up, good people? This is JJ here again, and this is a review demo of the um, New Neighbor Elements Collection Seraphim Shimmer Pedal. Now, in the Elements Collection are a lot of really cool ambient-type reverbs. New Neighbor, or Neunaber, I really don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, I guess it's New Neighbor. Uh, they're famous for their wet reverb, which is a very popular uh, reverb pedal. Uh, this basically gives you the sound of the of the wet reverb really nice uh, reverb sound but as a shimmer effect as an extra bonus on this this is like having two pedals in one uh, because it's a very compact enclosure just a single pedal format uh, when you want to bypass it just hit the foot switch like that and this is my dry guitar sound from my Kaufman's 56 uh, Strat just a dry sound and simply hit it to engage the pedal there's the regular reverb if you press and hold the foot switch and let it go as you can see the LED starts to blink that means uh, that the shimmer effect is active and you can also do that when the pedal is bypassed so if you want to start your passage with a shimmer effect make sure it's blinking hit the pedal for the shimmer so you can go from your uh, clean sound to your reverb sound to your shimmer sound uh, but you can also go from your uh, regular reverb sound go back and forth between shimmer uh, or non-shimmer so let me just let you hear what the um, shimmer effect does now if you don't know what a shimmer effect is um, uh, picture it like this if you picture a reverb as being lots of very diffuse little echoes uh, after one another uh, then what a shimmer does is each repeat is going to go up an octave so you get cascading octaves and you can hear that very nicely uh, when I increase the mix turn the depth down which is basically the reverb decay and let you hear uh, let you hear what the shimmer is actually doing <laughs> Let's add some more. Okay, and if you turn it all the way up, I'm guessing it produces some sounds that only your dog will be able to kick, uh, pick up. Okay, so that's what the shimmer does. You can isolate the shimmer by turning down on the reverb depth like this. So that makes for, uh, for some cool effects, I guess. Or not, whatever is your cup of tea. So let's turn down the shimmer all the way. I'm still in shimmer mode, and as you can tell, if I turn the depth and the shimmer down, uh, I basically get no reverb or shimmer, of course. But still, there's a very short, uh, short echo. Because if I turn the mix all the way up, I'm only getting the reverberated signal, even though everything's turned down. See? There's still a, d a delay in there, like an echo. So you can use that for a very subtle room kind of reverb. Like that. Okay, now let's let's increase the depth to about 12 o'clock. Actually, let's go back to the regular reverb mode, put the depth and the mix at 12 o'clock and let you hear what that sounds like. <laughs> So 
So it's subtle, uh, but there's still a lot of reverb going on, but it sits nicely behind your guitar tone. So if I turn off the seraphim... <laughs> pretty dry okay, let's turn it up even more so a longer decay And I can go for that infinite reverb kind of sound, which is great for your, um, for like your volume swells. Check this out. It's a nice kind of pad synth like thing. So you can do that too. Okay, now I will just um, increase the mix almost all the way up, put the depth at three o'clock and put the shimmer at 12 o'clock. Turn the shimmer on. I'll let you hear what that sounds like. So there you have it, a look at the new neighbor uh, mono Seraphim Shimmer. There's also a stereo version of this pedal, so you can run it to two different amps in a stereo rig or stereo inputs too. So use it for keyboards. It's a really beautiful sounding effect and the best thing about this, in my opinion, I love using big reverbs from time to time uh, when I'm recording, uh, but the best thing is that you can go back and forth between regular reverb and the shimmer effect because you don't want to use it all the time. Uh, just at certain passages to really get that angel choir kind of sound and this pedal does that in a very simple to use um, and compact enclosure so if you like that uh, please subscribe to my channel please share this video if you liked it and see you next time JJ out